Ten hut. Hi guys, General Splatten here. I want to do a quick video on my work area. Uh, I know you guys have never seen it before, so I thought I'd put one up. But also, uh, another fellow YouTuber by the name of McCannaman. I'll spell it out because I know I'm butchering his uh, name. Is holding a contest to win a free airbrush. And his contest was to show your work area, uh, what you're working on, and why you want a uh, airbrush. So that's what I'm doing today. Also, well, I'll get to that in a second. All right, let's go. First off, I'll give you a big view of it. You'll have to excuse the shaky cam. I've got a big floor lamp here, fluorescent lamp. I can move it around, do lighting for videos and whatnot. Then I have another light here and also a wall sconce. Okay, I use styrofoam plates as a mixing palette. This is my collection of game color paints. I uh, paid a lot of money for those, so yes, I still use them. They can be very frustrating for me at times, but uh, I make them work. I have a, these are my good brushes and cheap brushes, as you see there. This is a, my collection of P3 paints from Privateer Press. Excellent, excellent paints. Love them, love them, love them. Yeah, I don't have them all because I'm missing a few of the inks, but I do have all the paint itself. My collection of Andrea paints. We've got the black set, flesh set, and white set. Uh, over here, these are the Citadel washes that I use and Citadel paints. Then here is Reaper Master Series paints. A collection of glues, or at least some of them, right there. Down here is the tools I use most frequently, odds and ends, and the bits box there. And then this is caps for holding models if I use that method to hold them and paint them. I have a collection of Liquitex inks right here. This roll around cart here is full of models that are waiting 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 to be painted <laughs> I'll get them one year then down here this is basing material uh, for dioramas and bases and train pieces there so under here I have a collection of the cheap craft paints for uh, dioramas and whatnot along with uh, varnishes and primers and then some more tools there I have another area that's really, really messy that I'm not going to show where I display models and keep junk and office stuff as well. So uh, that's basically it. And then some works in progress right up there. Got some orcs. That's been there for a long time because other projects takes precedence. And then as far as the main project I'm working on right now, that is a 60 millimeter base for a uh, Warhammer 40k. Uh, I know McCannaman, you have no idea what that signifies, but some of you guys out there uh, get the reference, so <laughs> so that's what I'm working on right now. So that's the area. Uh, McCannaman uh, is based in Australia. He's a good guy. Uh, excellent modeler. Uh, he does uh, different types of models than most of us do. But uh, he's an excellent painter and a uh, guy worth checking out. So uh, you've already seen his uh, name on the screen. So uh, go check him out and sub and uh, also enter his contest. He's got a thousand subscribers. So uh, congratulations on that, buddy. Uh, that's a great feat uh, and many, many more. And also I want to give a shout out to Worthy Painting. He's a UK based guy uh, he's new to the uh, YouTube community he has a painting studio I told him I'd give him a shout out so uh, worthy painting uh, give him a look you see the name there or have seen it so uh, check him out as well uh, subscribe I think you're gonna find he's gonna have some good content uh, he's already got a few videos up and look forward to many more from him well, that's it uh, this time around. Uh, tell me what you think. Uh, it's not much, but I get the job done, as you see there. So, uh, 
look forward to your comments and uh, hopefully you'll have another video with my completed project uh, by the end of the week well uh, thanks uh, McCannaman for the uh, contest and why do I want a airbrush well it'll help me take my painting to another level it's never known I don't have this tool so this will give me an opportunity to experience a new part of the hobby uh, I want to get into painting vehicles and maybe doing some more uh, things in that nature so this will really help me out to grow as a painter and like I said experience a part of the hobby that I have not experienced before so um, that's why I would like an airbrush to, to have another tool to be able to uh, further my painting and my painting skills hopefully so that's it well if you got any questions let me know guys I uh, hope you enjoyed the video and I look forward to hearing what you got have to say well this is General Splatton I'll talk again dismissed